I knew it would happen. I wasn't sure how, but I knew. Rassilon's return and the Daleks' invasion of Gallifrey was just the beginning. Then there was a business with the Horde of Travesties. And over the many years that followed, smaller life forms thought they could challenge the gods who were fighting their perpetual battles with no sign of victory on either side. The Time Lords and the Daleks, stuck in an impasse. That was until the final days, at the fall of Arcadia. It was not long after the kingdoms that the could have been king and his armies of meanwhiles and neverwares had been overthrown. A small army, fresh from battle, was sent to Arcadia, the second city of Gallifrey, that had been invaded by the Daleks. There were stories of a special Dalek task force based here. A cult of Skaro. Simply rumours. But in war, all rumours have to be investigated. Our intel suggests the entire city is under Dalek control. We could be looking at another of the Skaro degradations. I thought we'd finished those things off years ago. No, this is different. We've been hearing of something new. Not just a group of Daleks outside of the Emperor's command, but above him. Like a secret order? Don't be ridiculous. The Time Lords had one. Yes, but that's different. You'd be advised to keep your opinions on the High Council to yourself, Doctor. Sorry, Commander. Does it offend you? After all, with Rassilon's new resurrection scheme, I hear you've been brought back from the dead at least, what, twelve times? How was that? I'm just doing my duty for our people. In my opinion, I don't think renegades should be involved in the war. If we could keep the playground arguments for time tots and get back to the situation at hand? There's a central tower set back into the ruins. We think that's where this Dalek group will be hiding. So, what's the plan? We make our way through the ruins and take the tower. So is President Rassilon expecting us back alive? Or should I get my will prepared now? You're not scared, are you? Wandering into a city of Daleks. I'd be extremely stupid if I wasn't. Let me remind you that I didn't want either of you here. But the President felt that this could be a strategic success and that you were ideal for the mission. Did you hear that, Emily? It's so nice to feel special. We're taking a series of sewer tunnels to a building on the east side of the city. There we will rendezvous with the Arcadian Resistance. They're going to lead us to the safest route. I should have known. I should have known something was wrong. But before I knew it, everything had spiralled out of control. The world came crashing down around us. And I knew then. I know what has to be done. travels in the sewers, where we met with the Arcadian Resistance. Zarl? Commander Taran? We came as fast as we could. Who are all these people? Our finest warriors. This man is the Doctor. The Doctor? You're a legend. They say your name is burned into... Please, I know what they say. I've not got time for that archaic, metaphorical stuff. I'm just a man who wants to put the universe back to normal. Very well. Come this way. We have a small base within the city. I thought the Daleks destroyed the city. They did. We made a refuge in the ruins. The Daleks seldom leave their tower. So what do the Daleks want here? What's so special about Arcadia? We shall tell you when we return to the base. The Daleks may not venture from the tower, but they still have eyes and ears everywhere. We must be cautious. Time Lords detected in the sewer system. The Doctor is with them. Why have the Time Lords journeyed to Arcadia? They must have discovered our intentions here! No, that is impossible. Even the Emperor does not know of our plan. Then what are your orders? We must inform the Emperor! No, we have all that we require here to destroy the invaders.
As you can see, these streets have been blocked off. Why not stick to the sewer tunnels? The same problem. The Daleks made sure no entrance to the tower was possible. So what are we going to do? Fly? Hardly. If the Daleks catch sight of any craft near the city, they'll shoot it down. So how do we break into this impregnable fortress? Through here. The entrance to the tower is closed off, but these ruins have a service duct that leads into the lower levels. It's decided then. We leave at once. Whoa, hang on a minute. We need to discuss this. Doctor, what do you think? I don't like it. Surely the Daleks would know about something like this. You're not here to think. You're here to- What? Fight? I am sick of fighting. I am sick of your pathetic war. I am sick of Rassilon and the High Council playing toy soldiers with the lives of others. Smaller races that keep getting caught in the crossfire. This is war. And I've been on the front line. Centuries of fighting across space and time, seeing my friends die, and for what? What is it for? Quiet! There's a Dalek patrol coming. You idiot! You nearly got us killed! That's enough! I don't want a loose cannon like him jeopardizing my mission. I'm sorry. You will be. We should leave here. Agreed. Weapons of the ready. Try not to engage the Daleks. This is a stealth mission. What if we do have to engage the Daleks? I'll call for backup. We're prepared for anything. Our craft is carrying an army. An army? I thought this was a stealth mission. Stay here. Keep us covered. Yes, sir. I have information for you. The building is up here. I don't like it. What now? No Daleks. We've got here too easily. Something's wrong. Nonsense! Ugh. Take cover! It was a trap! Turn to Starship! Turn to. Exterminate! I've got to help them! The Time Lord's craft has been destroyed. Excellent. The Arcadian informant has done well. Exterminate him. I obey. The ship is ready. What of the rift? We are ready to activate. Recall all Daleks. Let the Emperor fight his war. The Daleks will not survive. We must make our own plans for the Dalek race. And the Genesis Ark shall be the key to that plan. No! Come back! They wiped them out. Just like that. Why didn't they destroy Commander Taran's ship? What? They destroyed everything, but not that. Why did Taran arrive in a one-man craft in the first place? He was fighting on Pergonon, wasn't he? I wonder. That's the mission briefing. Not our mission. What? This is... This is something else. The ultimate sanction. They're retreating. Yes. It seemed your man did well. We did what you asked. Now, can President Rassilon deliver? Can he end the war? Give me my reward. Oh yes. The war's end is imminent. You've served your part. Here is your reward. Uh, sir! Ooh. Lord Rassilon, it is done. The Time Lords are dead. I am proceeding as ordered. Excellent. Inform me when your mission is complete. Thus, it is the law of Rassilon that I order the initiation of the ultimate sanction, whereby we shall ascend as the lords of time and all creation. What is this? Emily, look at this. Schematics for time-filled bombs. Like the cruciform? But what for? Arcadia is based on a rift in time and space. It's a backup power source. The Time Lords tapped into it years ago after the Daleks invaded the capital. If the bomb were to go off... It could rip a hole in the universe. But that's madness! Look at all of these names. Planets with known rift activity. And all of them are marked as sites for the time fields. Doctor, if those bombs detonate... Time itself would be ripped apart. Nothing would survive. Creation would be completely destroyed. But why would Rassilon order such a thing? He'll destroy everything! I think the ancient myths of Rassilon's evil went stories after him. And Commander Tarrant acting on those orders? Yes. Come on, we've got to get to that tower! The Genesis Park is sealed. Excellent! 
The void craft is ready. Prepare to board. Let the Emperor send our species to its destruction. When the time is right, we shall emerge and conquer all. The Daleks will reign supreme! Daleks? No. Not Daleks. An impulse laser. It destroyed the regeneration process instantly. Commander Taran, he killed them. Just like he's going to help destroy the universe. Come on! Where are you? They've gone. But where? No matter. Step away from there, now! All right. All right. Just don't shoot. You're too late, Doctor. We can't win this war. No one can. Face it. The only way we can have victory is by being the ones to end it all. You're mad. I think I've got a shot at him. Emily, no! <laughs> Emily? Oh, please. Please, no. Come on, please. Please don't do this. Not you two, please. D doctor? I'm here. You'll be all right. Come on, I can help you. I'm a doctor. I can. No. I can. I'll help you. I can. I can. Save us. So worried. No more. I promise you. No more. I stole his ship and returned to the Citadel. Unfortunately, there was a welcoming committee when I arrived. Where's Commander Taran? Take him to the President. What is the meaning of Doctor? He returned in Commander Taran's ship, my lord. Leave us. My lord? Leave us! Now! I was expecting Commander Taran to have come back from Arcadia to inform you that he'd sold out his own race to the Daleks, killed the Resistance, killed us, and planted the bomb in the rift. This was precisely the reason you were meant to die in Arcadia. You ordered the deaths of those soldiers. You sent them there to be killed. You sent Emily there to die. Yes, because I know what has to be done. There is only one option left to us, Doctor. I knew if I let you live, you'd try to oppose me. But not this time. The High Council haven't been informed about Arcadia yet. They don't even know you're here. No one does. Guards! Take the doctor to the detention area. Execute him. Prepare a meeting with the High Council, Castellan. I have received grave news from Arcadia. summoned you today in a time of great distress. Our forces on Arcadia have been slaughtered, wiped out by the Daleks. Commander Taran and his forces fought gallantly, but we have lost too much. Victories are becoming less and less. We are on the brink of destruction. However, there is one possibility, one option, the ultimate sanction. We can't win this war, but we cannot die. I will not allow it. We have been the bringers of peace and ordered calm. There was a time when our name evoked power and strength. No more. But we can have that power again. 
we can be lords not just of time, but of all creation. We can ascend beyond this mortal plane to a level of being where there is no war, where we are supreme, where a universe that continues to destroy itself is wiped from beneath us by our hand. What? The Daleks will be a threat to no one. The universe will no longer be a threat to itself. Stand with me, brother Time Lords. Stand with me for the end. Stand with me as Gallifrey rises! Oh, this is madness. I've got to rescue the Doctor. Did you hear them, Castellan? Cheers, roars, a thirst for power beyond all else. The Time Lords shall return to their glory. My Lord, there has already been some opposition to the notion. They will succumb. But my lord, what you're proposing to wipe out the universe just so we might live? You talk as if it were madness. Forgive me, my lord, but I sought to bring you back from death. I thought you would lead us from defeat and back to greatness. That is precisely what I am doing. Stand with me. I have supported all of your endeavors, but this, this is too much. This is monstrous. Not even we are worth such bloodshed, such unimaginable carnage. I am sorry you feel that way, Castellan. You understand if I ask you to resign? Of course, my lord. I will give up my personal effects immediately. I am afraid that is not good enough. <coughs> not good enough at all. Prepare weapons. Take aim. I'm sorry. Fire! Just stunned. Ramana! We need to get back to the TARDIS. Ramana, I have to tell you something. Gallifrey's gone mad. Rassilon is planning- I know, I know. There's something else. It'll have to wait. We need to get out of here. Hot or I'll- oh! Get a key for this thing. Hurry! My lord. What's happening? The doctor, sir, he's escaped with the Lady Romana. Stop them! Kill them both! Get us out of here! I'm sorry, sir, they were too quick for us. We didn't have time to put up a dematerialization barrier. cave on the mountainside out in the wastelands. I used to come here when I needed guidance. What are we going to do, Doctor? Romana. It's madness! Romana, please. Complete and utter- Romana, shut up! Doctor? Where's Emily? No. I couldn't. Save her. That's what happened. Rassilon ordered those Time Lords to be killed. He wanted to convince the High Council to side with his plan. And from the side of things, most are siding with him. What? Times are desperate. We've been fighting for so long. I know. I know. I think you've seen better than anyone the effects it has on a person. What it does to them. I killed him. I didn't even think about it. He killed her, and I killed him. Anyone in your situation would have- No, no, that's no excuse. I taught all of you, everyone who has ever traveled with me, to be better than that. And now look at me. I wanted to travel. I wanted to see the stars, to help people. What have I become? This war has changed us all. Look at the Time Lords. We've become monsters. This isn't war. This is hell. And it stops today. Doctor? Doctor, where are you going? The DMAT gun? But you said it was destroyed. No. I hoped I would never have to use this again. Doctor, what- You're right. This isn't war anymore. This is hell. The Daleks aren't the only threat out there. We are. The Time Lords. They're killing their own kind. They killed Emily. 
What are you going to do? I'm going to end it. I'm going to kill Russell. Whoa!